Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're asked to use the given graph of f, which we have right here, to state the value of each quantity if it exists. If it does not exist, explain why. So we have these six options here. So first we have the limit as x approaches 2 from the left of f of x. So x is equal to 2 is right here. And coming at it from the left, we see that it approaches this point right here, which has a y value of 3. Therefore, this limit is equal to 3. Similarly, as we approach 2 from the left, or sorry, from the right, given by this plus sign, from the right, we see it approaches this point right here, which has a y value of 1, which means that the limit is equal to 1. The limit of f of x as it approaches, um, as x approaches 2, does not exist, because from the left and the right, it approaches different values. Right? So that means as we come to 2, there isn't a common value that we're approaching. The limit does not exist. D and E does not exist. F of 2 has nothing to do with the limit, but is the value of the function at that point, which if we look here is the solid closed endpoint, as opposed to the open circle, which just means it approaches it, but it doesn't actually hit it. So that means the value of F at 2 is this point right here, which has a y value of 3. The limit as x approaches 4 of f of x, this means x equals 4 is right here. The function is approaching this point right here from both sides, as opposed to here where it wasn't approaching a single point but two points. Here, both sides from both directions are coming together to this point, which has a y value of 4. However, at 4, notice that we have an open circle, which means the function does not exist. Right? We don't have a closed circle or a line passing through at x equals 4, therefore f of 4, d and e does not exist.